Who are you? Do not worry. I'm a friend. Don't you recognize me? I am Fiora, the great-granddaughter of the wizard Maron. Fiora? Little Braveheart. You're a big girl now. Yeah, and my troubles are big as well. You see, I did not know whom to turn to, so I have studied the records of my great-grandfather and found out how to call you. And what about Marin himself? Did you do this in secret? Maron was taken captive by a witch, Cassandra. Now she calls the shots in the Lost Lands, and those are her arachnoids snooping around and searching for undesirables. Do you want me to help Marin to escape? Not really. Before his disappearance, Great-Grandfather spent a lot of time in his secret laboratory. It is for sure somewhere in a local forest, though I've never been inside. I learned from him that he was working on some powerful weapon against Cassandra. We have to get there and find out to leave. Just do not go back. They are looking for you there. We'll escape through the upper door. to the underground is under one of the gravestones.
This is Maron's laboratory. We need to study everything here and find out what he was working on before Cassandra captivated him. Save us, Mount Gore. She's awake. Cassandra got out of the crypt. Now she snoops around the lost lands, finds the strongest men, and turns them into arachnoids. Others are being enslaved or killed. It's my fault. If I had obeyed her orders, nothing would have happened. There is still hope, even if times are hard. I am currently working on a device that will let me go back in time and fix everything. I call it Time Hexagon. Time Hexagon? That's interesting. So, I need to go almost five centuries ago, namely in the year 3088, from the creation of the Tarsus on August 23rd, 20 minutes after midnight. The Hexagon operates from ancestor ashes that can be found at any cemetery. Just the usual corpse ashes, taken not from an animal, but from a rational being. The time slip must be performed within the cemetery, this place has been chosen for a good reason. This is the very place where everything has happened. And in no case can you make a time slip while in the laboratory. In the past, the symmetry already existed, but the laboratory did not. You can easily get stuck in the ground and never get back. It's good you warned. I keep the hexagon in the workshop. Just in case, here is the password to open the door. Incredible. Great-grandfather wanted to go back in time. I wonder what happened there. I must find it out. I'll go back to the past instead of Marin. Well, maybe you're right. Then I'll stay here and try to study all other materials. I must find the time hexagon.
Am I already in the past? It's not quite clear yet. The landscape is different, though. I need to figure it out. always been my most faithful and best student. Cassandra, thank you for all the knowledge you shared with me. Cassandra? Forgive me for asking you to do this, but please understand that this is for the best. Goodbye, Marin. Goodbye. Marin? This won't hurt a bit. Is Marin talking to? Marin, be sure that this potion will cast Cassandra into a deep lethargic sleep for many centuries, while her body will remain untouchable. Simply put, it will not be possible to kill her in a usual way. Just as you want it, she will be safe. Now I will have enough time to find a cure for her disease. Do you regret disobeying Cassandra? Helma, she asked me to kill her. How could I? She just wanted to protect the world from her disease. So Cassandra was sick. It does not matter anymore. It's a done deal. Helma, take this coin. It can open the crypt so that you can look after Cassandra while I'm away. You are the only one I can trust. Oh. I hope this deception will not destroy us in the future. What? What happened? Oh no! The hexagon ran out of ashes! Apparently I automatically returned to the present.
So, maybe somewhere in this trash I'll find the key to the hut. It's worth looking. It seems that no one has lived in this house for a long, long time.
bingo. I did it. Now I need to try to talk to the witch. What do you want? Hello, I'm Susan. So what? I need to talk to you about Marin. I have no idea what you are talking about. Just go away. Susan! Thanks, Montgore. You're back. What did you find out? Oh, I don't know where to start. It turns out that Cassandra was Marin's teacher, and it was her who taught him the art of magic. You mean Cassandra was a kind person before? What happened so that she has become such an angry witch? She suffered from some disease. I don't know the details, but the disease made rapid progress. Then, it seems that Cassandra told Marin to kill her, so that the infection would not spread all over her body and turn her into something... evil. But he deceived his teacher, and with good intentions gave her not a deadly poison, but a potion that casted Cassandra into a lethargic sleep and kept her body untouchable. Marin wanted to gain some time to find a cure for her disease in that way. That settles it. He didn't find the medicine, and Cassandra eventually turned evil. That's why he regrets not following her will back then. I think Marin wanted to go back in time and kill Cassandra. Maybe I could do this instead of him. What? Will you really go there? Yes. There's no other way. I'll ask a Swamp Witch for help. I just need some evidence to prove I've been sent by Marin. Check his chest. Maybe you'll find something. Here, I just found a key that opens it. <laughs> 